ever pondered the nature of gravity, this invisible force that keeps us grounded? But what if we told you it might not be a fundamental force at all? Traditionally, gravity has been viewed as one of the primary forces of nature, as described by Einstein's theory of general relativity. It's the unseen force that binds the universe, holding celestial bodies in their orbits and keeping our feet firmly on the ground. But imagine for a moment if gravity isn't a fundamental force. What if it's something that emerges from more basic underlying phenomena? This is the intriguing concept of emergent gravity. Theories such as Eric Verlinda's entropic gravity and approaches to quantum gravity suggest that gravity may not be a primary force, but rather a resultant of the way information is distributed in space or the quantum structure of space-time itself. Prepare to delve into a world where gravity might just be a consequence of other more fundamental phenomena. Imagine gravity not as a standalone force, but as a result of the collective behavior of other more fundamental entities. Yes, you heard that right. Gravity, the force that binds us to our planet, could be a result of something more basic, more fundamental. This is the intriguing concept of emergent gravity. So what does it mean for gravity to be emergent? Well, in the realm of theoretical physics, the term emergent is used to describe phenomena that arise from the collective behavior of simpler, more fundamental entities. Think of the way a flock of birds moves in unison, creating beautiful and complex patterns. Each bird follows simple rules, but together they create something more complex, more profound. That's an example of an emergent phenomenon. Now apply this concept to gravity. The idea is that gravity is not an independent fundamental force. Instead, it emerges from the collective behavior of other more basic entities, such as quantum fields or particles. One compelling proposition in this regard is Eric Verlinde's theory of entropic gravity. Verlinde, a theoretical physicist proposes a radical interpretation of gravity. He suggests that gravity is not a fundamental force, but arises from the way information is distributed in space. The term entropic comes from the concept of entropy, which is, in a nutshell, a measure of disorder or randomness in a system. According to Verlinde, gravity is an entropic force. It arises from the universe's tendency to increase in disorder or entropy. To put it simply, Imagine a library. The books in the library represent information. If the books are well organized, the library has low entropy. But if someone comes along and randomly rearranges the books, the entropy increases. Similarly, gravity could emerge from the universe's tendency to rearrange information, increasing entropy. So gravity, in this light, becomes an entropic force, a manifestation of the universe's tendency towards disorder. This new perspective on gravity challenges our traditional views and paves the way for a deeper understanding of the universe. But how does this fit into our understanding of quantum mechanics and the fabric of space-time itself? Well, let's delve into the fascinating world of quantum gravity. This is where we merge the principles of quantum mechanics, which governs the tiny particles, with the laws of gravity, which rule the massive celestial bodies. Emergent gravity fits quite snugly into quantum gravity frameworks. Two prominent examples are loop quantum gravity and string theory. In loop quantum gravity, for instance, space-time itself isn't a continuous expanse. Instead, it's woven from tiny, discrete loops. Gravity, then, is not a separate force, but an integral part of this quantum tapestry of space-time. On the other hand, there's string theory, where the universe's fundamental building blocks are not particles, but minuscule vibrating strings. The different vibrational modes of these strings give rise to the variety of particles we know, including gravity-carrying particles called gravitons. So in this scenario, gravity emerges from the symphony of these vibrating strings. Now, what does all this mean for our understanding of gravity? The notion of emergent gravity suggests that gravity is not a standalone fundamental force, as Einstein's theory of general relativity proposes. Instead, it's an outcome, or an emergent property, of the collective behavior of other more fundamental entities, like quantum fields or particles. This not only gives us a fresh perspective on gravity, but also potentially illuminates the path towards the unification of gravity with other fundamental forces in physics a puzzle that has stumped scientists for decades. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. 
it's important to remember that emergent gravity is still a developing area of research. There's much we don't know, and many questions are yet to be answered. It's a subject of active investigation and debate within the theoretical physics community. This revolutionary concept challenges our traditional views, suggesting gravity could be understood in terms of more fundamental principles. It's not just a force, it's a manifestation of the very structure of the universe.